This is my fifth and final episode of Wild Oceans in the Sogod Bay in the Philippines. And I'm starting today's episode with quite a risky close-up of this enormous Titan trigger fish. They are fiercely protective of their territory, uh, particularly when they're nesting. A sure sign that you're going to be attacked by a triggerfish is when they turn slowly and look at you like that. And they'll rush in and give you a very nasty bite. They've got very strong teeth. But this guy was fairly content to just hang around and get a clean. He's being cleaned by those two blue streaked cleaner ass right now. And then he was in and out of this patch of coral here where he's obviously found something delicious to eat. This is a typical reef scene on the Sogod Bay. Lots of strong, healthy, hard coral. The water column filled with damselfish. Lots of different kinds of anemones. And these guys are pretty well known to everyone. Western clownfish. Made famous by that film, Finding Nemo. Lots of different kinds of nudibranchs all over the dive sites. Now, this has got to be one of my favorite kinds of fish to film because they look so beautiful. Of course, he's a clown trigger fish. And they're quite difficult to film, they're very shy. But I love their colorations. I mean, look at this guy. It looks like he was painted in art class. Big white spots on his belly. Bright orange lipstick. A pair of white sunglasses. A yellow tail. They really are something. And I finish these episodes of the So God Bay with something a bit special. It's a green turtle, critically endangered sea turtle, uh, found less and less throughout the world. It was the one and only green turtle that I saw in the four or five days of diving. Him swimming away into the blue. 